Hello everyone, Mies1 Jr. here. We're back in Stellaris, playing Star Trek New Horizons. We're at war with the Romulans, and I'm not sure how we're going to do this. Because I don't fully understand the mechanics on how the United Federation of Planets functions in this in this mod. Uh, we have no direct control, it seems, over capital worlds, or capital systems. Um... <clears throat> And no direct control over, um, I don't know, for example, uh, oh, there was, oh, excuse me, there was a system, oh, you know what, let's just for kicks, let's revoke that. Oh, that's Axnar. Never mind, this one doesn't count. This was one of ours to begin with. I don't know what I was thinking. Okay. But more importantly... Let's see, 35, minus 1, 1, 2, 2, 4, and 3. Okay, Earth, you are our highest grossing planet. Let's see, 10 years, 15% extra energy credits. That helps a little bit. Okay. That'll stem, well, like, even the flow a little bit. Okay. It's a two point five K stack. It's very strange. This whole uh, the system is very strange. I don't know exactly how to uh, how to deal with it. This uh, <laughs> this campaign may come to a short and swift end. Oh, wait. There we go. Maybe not, maybe not yet. Trade attractiveness. Actually, no. Orbital hydroponics, because we are struggling to produce food, and I would really rather... Um, and 1.1 and 2.5. Is that all? Is that all they have available? I severely hope not. Okay, so I think this is accession to the United... Okay, so it is a long and detailed process. While well, basic principles are often agreed early, the minutia of the Federation's legal framework, trade regulations, and contributions to Starfleet often require substantial investments in time and material from Federation government in order to progress. The diplomatic service has compiled a list of options available. Okay. So low-intensity negotiations with the Betazoid houses... 
20% chance of accession progress variable to 4. Okay, so we have a 42% chance of 12. I don't know what that means. But we'll go with it. Okay, so they're going for... Looks like they're going for like little occupations. So those, those don't count towards a lot of war score. What we could do is actually build some more destroyers. We could build one. So we will build one. Transport hub. I'll take the cheap tech. That invasion is over. And we're t finally turning positive, positive stuff. That's the mine 10, 13, 40, 13, 40, call it 15, 50, 1600. This is not good. <clears throat> the good news is it's going to take them some time, I think, to actually... Oh, great. Negative balance. Oh, wait. Did I mess that up in the ship designer? I did. But they're the same. Nothing there. Damn it. It's not going well. Retour. Creation tree, don't want to deal with those now. Failed an invasion, gain a level. Great. I'm curious. They're not putting any, um, They don't seem to be, like, leaving troops. We'll just go land some stuff. Good. We now have Orbital Hydroponics. Um, we'll take that one for now. Two food. That's this isn't the This is the planet. I'm more nope, not this one. It's This is a good one. Wait. It's got a maintenance of two. Provides four food. means we could probably move off three food, right? And on to four. Yeah, no, that's fine. We'll do it. This is another good one. Yeah, 
Yikes. Shields. Do we even have shields yet? I don't know, but it's cheaper, so we'll take it. Next month, we can build one more destroyer. Done. Oh my god. Those occupations are adding up. Get wrecked. This is bad. This is not good. Yikes. Okay, they jumped into a system they already had. They are warping to Procyon. Yikes. You do have some defensive home guard though. Up to him. Uh, okay, fleets detected. Construction complete. Fleet detected. New tech. Dry dock. Spatial torpedoes. Mining network two. I think we'll research that. Okay, I'm making positive food, which means you can go there. Okay. 
Where else was it? Where else did we make one? Tau Seti. Actually, you guys can go there. All right, cool. I think we've balanced that pretty well. Good. Liberated a planet. That's what's up. Now that you guys don't have a reason for being here, where are you guys going now? Moving to the... Alright, oh, moving here. Okay. Yeah, they're winning that. I'm curious about this this ground fight though. Slowly losing influence. I'm kind of thinking it's worthwhile getting rid of this. <clears throat> okay, and the Andorians look like they're training more troops. Okay, we'll just uh, keep doing that, I think. Altair Prime. What were we building on Altair Prime? Oh, we were upgrading the Starbase. Currently at two food. Yeah, I think we just have to ride that out. Let's see, is there any energy credit system anywhere that we have missed? Right there, that's two, but that's not something we're going to deal with at the moment. Okay, you return home. So I think we take a break here. We've taken one system back, but I'm not sure how well or how... It's a tall order right now. It's a very tall order. Oh, and this, you know what? This fight's going on. And, oh my god. 3.01 to 6.03. 2.25 to 4.50. Wow. So we're going to lose Procyon. Done. Lost it. Great. And this does not look promising. That's what I get for playing on hard difficulty. Let's 
does not look good. So if you're enjoy the series, if you're just going to see my butt get kicked, hit that like button. If you're enjoying the channel, please subscribe. And uh, hopefully we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.